Okay, here we are at Send Out Cards. Let's take a quick tour of what we're looking at here. First of all, I'm going to point out that we are not at www.sendoutcards.com. We are at new.sendoutcards.com. At the time that I'm making this video, Send Out Cards is rolling out a new platform, a new website, and they are currently running both the old and new sites at the same time. I am only going to do trainings on the new website because this this is what's going to happen. Sometime very soon the old website is going to go away and this is what you're going to have to deal with. So this is what I recommend you get comfortable with right now. If you come up over here um, and just hover over this little face, uh, let's see, click on it. There you can see your own personal information. You can see what your balance is on your points, which is what the credits, points are the credits that you use for creating cards and for purchasing gifts and three dollars and fifty six cents expense I'm gonna need to add some in here but this is what is used for postage and shipping and this will be your default return address and um, you can't see that here because I'm I'm hiding that uh, to respect my clients uh, privacy if you hover over the main menu you can see you have a lot of options. These are all things under your account. You can go to your dashboard, uh, your photo manager, you can see your card history, you can see your order history, you can see your sincere account, the SOC photo store. Um, these are all things that you can explore. The Revolution office is only available to distributors. Um, so that's not something that this particular account that I'm showing you here is a customer account so you won't see anything from there. Um, as well as splash packs or card sharing kits. These are only for distributors. Purchase products. Let's just go to purchase products to show you what's there and then we'll come back to this main menu. Under the purchase products menu, you're going to see a lot of things that you could get. Um, you can get uh, points, preferred customer points at 39 cents each, or you can set up a subscription a custom branding package. This is a fantastic uh, tool here. It is $149 um, up front because that is them setting up the machines. But this custom branding package, what it allows you to do is to personalize the back of every card with information about your business, about your family perhaps, if you have uh, cards that you're going to send personally. You can uh, customize the back of the card with information about your blog. So setting that up takes some, some time and effort. So there's a $149 charge and then annually there's a renewal of $49. This is a phenomenal investment if you're using this for business. And even if you're not, it's a really fun tool, but then you just have to look at it that way. But for business, th this can really change how you're branding and connecting with your people. Uh, you can add to your expense account for postage gift cards um, and any uh, shipping and handling expenses. It's a dollar per unit, but you buy five units minimum. Uh, you can also buy separately a font creation or just your signatures. Um, so that's just to give you an idea of what you can find under the products menu. You can also purchase postage um, on your way out while you're checking out with the card to have it sent if you want to have a different type of stamp put on it or if you need to send something internationally. Okay, back to the main menu. We went through very fast through my account. Your contact manager, if you want to find a specific contact, create a new contact, import contacts from a spreadsheet, look at your groups, or look at your calendar, that's where all of this will be. And this is your campaign manager. Campaigns are when you create one or more cards that you're going to send for specific events. It could be, say, a one card campaign where every customer who buys from you at a specific event is going to get a thank you card for purchasing at that event. It could be a multi-card campaign where you create cards for each uh, holiday of the year and then as you enter a client or a customer into that campaign, send out cards will automatically personalize and send that card to each person you add to the campaign. Fantastic tool, totally worth 
totally worth learning how to do. Return to Classic takes you back to the old version of the site, and again, I told you I really recommend you don't do that. Up here you have a couple shortcuts. The company menu is basically if you want to learn more about what's happening with send out cards or upcoming events, you can find that information here. Also, if you need to contact them, clicking on support will take you to a page that has um, email addresses, phone numbers, uh, often um, there's a live chat available, right? See this um, speech balloon here? Um, if that's green, live chat is available. Their offices are closed when I'm doing this recording, um, which is why it's red with a white X in it. But if it's green, you can just click on that and you can usually just do your, your um, ask your question right in a chat box and get done really quick. All right, if you're, you know, you just get in here, you don't need to go through these menus, you know you want to send a card, you know you want to send a gift, you just click on those. Okay, so I'm going to take you to the dashboard just so you can see the information that's on the dashboard. And because this is a customer account, pretty much it's um, send a card. And then as we scroll down, we see some other information about things that are possible, uh, different options to consider. Go ahead and log into your send out cards account remember new.sendoutcards.com and explore and uh, that was a really quick overview like I said and um, I will be making other recordings to cover other tasks that you'll be doing through send out cards thanks for watching